Hello everyone and welcome back to Far North Queensland. Today I am near the town of Corunda, filming in my car for now, but I'm at Barron Falls, which if you've heard of it, is an extremely famous, humongous waterfall on the Barron River, which is unfortunately regulated by hydro, so usually only has a little bit of water flowing, but three months ago, huge floods came through and basically destroyed the hydro infrastructure, so now it's flowing really well all the time, and it pissed down last night, so I reckon we're going to see something very very spectacular today now as well as the falls i'm also going to go on down to the base of the waterfall down a secret old track which i've done before a couple of years ago and made a video but today i'm going to make another one with the falls at full blast so looking forward to it let's go check it out only 10 minutes down this way to look out little look out on the way down first glimpse of the falls Looking pretty awesome. It's so cool just walking through the rainforest like this and the whole time you just got this thunderous roar just kind of off to the side. Kind of builds the anticipation as you get close to the waterfall because there is so much water coming through. Really looking forward to this lookout. Well, made it to the main lookout here and what an amazing view this is. I'll give you a look. So on the railway platform, head to the very end of it here. And then we're going to jump over this fence and there's an old trail to pick up. Let's do it. So what I will say is the cyclone has made this track a little bit harder than it used to be as right at the start there's a land that you've got to kind of get around. But after that, it actually becomes quite a good track because this used to be like a tourist route that people would walk down way back in the day. So there's proper stairs. And it's quite a nicely made track the further down you go. Just obviously fenced off now, so I guess technically not really allowed to walk it. But as long as you're safe and know what you're doing, should be no issues really. This gives you some idea, just kind of going down these switchbacks. And yeah, as I was saying, a very, very well constructed trail. Just giving you some idea of what you're in for here. Starting to get below the height of the waterfall. Still see the track underfoot, there's stairs and stuff, but it is quite overgrown as we sort of head down this like narrow ridge line. Loads of spiders across the track, so I'm sort of trying to film and then walk so I don't walk into any. Anyways, still going. It goes without saying, you want to take extreme care on this walk. These stairs are really slippery and steep. There's a pretty decent sized drop off still. Come to a point near the base now where it looks like the track kind of goes through this big wall there. So this whole stuff of grass. And if you look closely, you'll see the resumption of the stairs. Last flight now. What a view this is. And look at the destruction. The floods come down, completely wiped out the base of the waterfall there and all the rainforest that used to be down there. Just a little bit more. Wow, what a view. The base of Barron Falls. Hard yakka getting down here, but worth every step. Just a spectacular sight. Now, what I will mention, I reckon that track's got a lot worse since two years ago when I last came. Really, really overgrown the stairs. So a lot of the time you have to look extremely closely to see where to put your feet, or you're in a bit of strife. So definitely only do it if you're well prepared and experienced hiking pretty rugged terrain but if you're up for it unbelievable
Alrighty, so I've got a nice little perch hanging out across from the waterfall. Figure I might as well wrap the video up here because there are so many people on the track and I hate talking in front of people, I feel like an idiot. Anyways, um, I mean, Barren Falls is just spectacular. Even in the dry season, it's still a pretty impressive waterfall with a little bit of water, but after rain, it is just magnificent and probably the most impressive falls in Australia at its best. The walk down to the base is really difficult. There is a good track underneath, but it's so overgrown now, you've got to be extremely careful. And today it was really, really slippery as well. But I mean, regardless of what you do, it's a must visit place, especially if you're in the wet season, come into Cairns and um, yeah. Hope you enjoy the, the trek down to the base. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.